Imagine a world where insects are not just tiny nuisances, but colossal creatures that ruled the Earth. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're venturing into a bizarre and fascinating world where insects weren't just tiny nuisances, but colossal creatures that ruled the Earth. Have you ever wondered about the reality behind the giant bugs we see in movies? Were there really mega insects? And if so, how big were they? Let's embark on this thrilling journey through time. Let's kick things off by unveiling the astonishing creatures that once skittered across Earth. First up, the Meganeura, a majestic dragonfly that lived around 300 million years ago during the Carboniferous period. Imagine a dragonfly the size of a hawk with a wingspan stretching up to two and a half feet. This wasn't just a trick of perspective. These dragonflies thrived in an environment with abundant lush vegetation and high oxygen levels, which allowed them to grow to such impressive sizes. High oxygen levels allowed insects to grow larger than any we see today. In fact, it's believed that atmospheric oxygen levels were about 35%, significantly higher than the 21% we have today. This unique condition fueled the growth of these giant insects that also had fewer natural predators. Next, we have the incredible Arthropleura often referred to as the largest cockroach ever discovered. Measuring over six feet in length, this creature roamed the lush, swampy environments of the Carboniferous and Permian periods. But hold on, while it looks similar to a modern cockroach, Arthropleura was actually more closely related to millipedes. Its size would have made it a king in its territory, feasting on decaying plant matter and even other insects. And then we can't forget about the fascinating giant ants known as Formicium which lived during the Eocene Epoch around 50 million years ago. While they were considerably smaller than Meganeura and Arthropleura, Formicium was still a giant in the ant world. These colony-dwelling insects displayed complex behavior and were likely predators of other insects, showcasing the impressive evolution of social insects during this time. Now, how do we know these prehistoric giants existed? This is where we hit the limits of science. The fossil record provides evidence of these incredible creatures, but it's important to understand its limitations. Fossils tell only part of the story. While we can see the outlines and structures of these insects, they don't reveal their color, behavior, or how they interacted with their environment. Paleontologists use a combination of fossil evidence and modern techniques, such as DNA analysis, to reconstruct the past. By studying the morphology and anatomy of fossils, Scientists can make educated guesses about how these creatures behaved and lived. But remember, while Hollywood loves to exaggerate, most of the giant bugs we see in films often have no counterpart in reality. Movies tend to amplify these creatures' sizes to create more suspense and drama. But could you imagine walking through a park and encountering a giant spider or a human-sized cockroach? Some depictions, while thrilling on screen, enhance their features to an almost cartoonish level, straying far from scientific truth. Let's explore the timeline of insect evolution a bit more. During the Carboniferous period, life's conditions were perfect for insect giants. High temperatures and oxygen levels allowed insects to grow to remarkable sizes. However, as Earth's atmosphere changed over millions of years, oxygen levels began to drop leading to the decline of these mega insects. By the time we reach the end of the Permian period and into the Mesozoic era, the economic climate for insects was drastically different. Those high oxygen levels were no longer sustainable and many of the giant insects disappeared. The creatures that survived were smaller, more suited to adapt to the changing climate and their new ecological niches. Interestingly, the descendants of these ancient giants still exist. Modern insects come in all shapes and sizes, showcasing incredible adaptations that enable them to thrive, like camouflage to avoid predators, unique mating rituals, and the ability to fly. They may not be the mega monsters of the past, but they possess evolutionary traits that make them fascinating in their own right. Now, let's discuss the impact that these ancient giants have had on today's ecosystems. Insects may be small, but they are vital to our ecosystems. They play critical roles in pollination, decomposition, and pest control. Without insects, many of the plants we rely on for food would struggle to survive. Today, scientists continue to delve into insect research, 
uncovering new information about their evolutionary history and their impact on the planet. With the ongoing threat of climate change, understanding how insects adapt is more important than ever. For example, research has shown that certain beetles can withstand changes in temperature by altering their metabolic rates. So, while some of the mega insects portrayed in popular culture may be exaggerated, the real story of these ancient creatures is just as captivating, showcasing the incredible resilience and adaptability of life on Earth. Thank you for joining us on this adventure into the world of prehistoric mega insects. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that notification bell for more exploration into the wonders of our natural world. And I'd love to hear from you. What did you find most surprising about these prehistoric critters? Leave your comments below and until next time, stay curious.